is the world facing disaster? There is a beautiful saying, when you lose your possessions, you don't lose anything. When you lose your health, you lose something. And when it loses value, it loses everything. Man's greatest wealth is peace. Although you have a lot of money but not sure you are safe. Real wealth is contentment. There are people who spend half of their lives making money in stress, tricks and the other half use the money they earn to cure illnesses. This money creates more suffering than happiness. And today, people are experiencing the three most recognizable disasters recently. That is the outbreak of COVID-19, the scorching heat in Antarctica and the 400 billion grasshoppers attacking crops. What are the consequences of these specific phenomena? 1. Situation of COVID-19 up to date March 06, 0637 GMT plus 7, South Korea has so far 6,284 cases of COVID-19 after recording an additional 518 new cases, 42 deaths. The United States also has at least 210 infected people, 14 deaths. The U.S. Senate has approved an emergency budget of $8.3 billion. The COVID-19 epidemic has struck 86 countries and territories around the world, infecting 97473 people and killing at least 3358 people worldwide. 2. A nine-day heat wave burned the northern part of Antarctica in early February, melting 20% of the snow covering an island. Antarctica experienced the hottest day on record this month, peaking at 64.9 degrees Fahrenheit, 18.3 degrees Celsius. That same day, the temperature in the city of Los Angeles, USA is similar. It is said that never before has a lake been created by melting snow so rapidly in Antarctica. According to the World Meteorological Organization's report, rising sea levels could be catastrophic for millions of people living along the world's coastlines. 3. 400 billion grasshoppers are invading the Earth. Somalia has recently become the first country to declare its current locust problem a national emergency, potentially threatening the country's fragile food security situation. According to the UN warning, the current desert grasshopper outbreak could spread across the territory of 60 countries, affecting more than 20% of the Earth's area and could ruin the livelihoods of 1 in 10 of the population. World. Pakistan declared a national emergency in early February, saying the grasshopper epidemic is at its peak and worst in more than 20 years. Scientists say that grasshoppers can fly up to 150 kilometers slash day if windy, and billions of grasshoppers can eat one amount of food for 35,000 people to eat in a day. Grasshopper victims in Kenya, Africa have not shown signs of stopping. According to the United Nations, this could be the worst grasshopper epidemic in 70 years. A herd of grasshoppers can hold millions of children, and once the number of these wind insect pests reaches a certain size, they will become the unrivaled natural force that will spread out over square kilometers. Instead of conclusion, no one is unscathed when the world's second economy, China, goes down. Even if the rest of the world succeeds in stopping the coronavirus, the global economy will suffer badly. Antarctica is heating up rapidly due to human heat trapping and will have serious global consequences, especially for the millions of people living along the coast, vulnerable to rising sea levels. Historically, there were years called five grasshoppers when these beetles raged and caused great consequences. With a rapid proliferation of grasshoppers, there will be a conflict of food sources with a cattle on the pasture. In addition, a strong outbreak will result in disruption of farming activities in many parts of the world. The world's food is seriously threatened. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe, like for the channel so we can continue to make other videos for you watching and keep track of new developments. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like and share.